Arena Breakout is one of those expectation versus reality things where the expectation is amazing and the reality is not so great. In this case, the trailer is amazing and the gameplay is not so great. Essentially, Arena Breakout is Escape from Tarkov on mobile, but what we're going to do is have a look at how well they put together the trailer for this game. And just quickly, before we jump into it, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, sub to the channel, and check out the links in the description if you want to support me further as a creator. Thank you to everyone that does support the channel, and uh, let's get into this trailer. So, more fun studios present... Here we go, getting into the trailer. I'm not even going to talk over the top of it. This one got fucked up real bad. Hey, boss. Check this out. Let me see that. Body's so warm. They might be close. Hmm. Nice optics. Extraction point's two clicks ahead. Let's go, ladies. So, that's the trailer for Arena Breakout. It's gritty, it's, like, it's dull, it's intense, it's action-packed. I like the way they did the camera on the front of the gun. They played dramatic sounds every time someone picked the gun up. It's a really, really encouraging, hype-building trailer that they put together. And what we're going to do now is switch over to the gameplay, and we'll take a look at this game. So... You uh, already know by the title, I've said Escape from Tarkov Mobile. This is uh, some Android and iOS gameplay of Arena Breakout. You remember the trailer we've just watched, right? This is the, uh, the gameplay that goes with it. And I'm going to talk over the top of the gameplay. I'm not going to play the sound. It's all playing in like Chinese. The audio's like fully Chinese. But just looking at it, it's really vibrant. It's colourful. It's mobile, so the graphics are terrible. Just look. They put together that really good trailer, and this is the gameplay we get. And not only that, it's a mobile game. There's going to be microtransactions and stuff in this game. It's, like, free on mobile to play, as far as I'm aware, so they need to make their money somehow, and on mobile games, there's a lot of microtransactions, typically. And, uh, yeah, there you go. There's, like, an inventory and stuff like that when you're looting. It just seems as though it looks a little bit like Call of Duty mixed with Escape from Tarkov. You've got a really colourful setting. You've got 
and I, I don't even know. I'm just so disappointed after seeing that trailer that this is the fucking gameplay to back up the game. It's just so stupid. The mobile gaming market is just becoming worse and worse. They're throwing out these really good trailers like Ubisoft are making the division res like resurgence and it's a bloody mobile game, but it's essentially a mobile port of The Division 1. And they'll release it on mobile so that they can make all the revenue. That's what a lot of companies do. You've got, what is it, you've got Warzone on mobile, you, like Call of Duty mobile. You've got Apex Legends mobile. You've got Fortnite mobile. There's just so much of it. It's unbelievable. And I'm gutted the trailer was like that. I know they like pretty much have to release a trailer and make it look as good as they can to build up hype and everything. It is not so much the trailer. I'm gutted. It's a mobile game. We need more things like that trailer to be gameplay for a PC slash console game, not mobile. But what I'm going to do is pause that there. We've seen a little bit of the gameplay. We've watched the trailer. In my opinion, I think it is just Escape from Tarkov Mobile. But that was the trailer verse gameplay and the big, big difference. I hope that a development company can at some point in the future, hopefully not too long, like not too many years, but hopefully put together a game that's like similar in the... Like the tension, the build up, the, the gunplay, the fact that they like push that sniper, just something like that put into a PC and console game because that would be amazing. But what we're going to do is leave that video there, check out some other videos on the channel, let me know your thoughts and stuff about this in the comments, and I'll see you in the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for watching.